Hello YouTube, welcome back to another review video. Today I would like to review NASA Supersonic Flying Laboratory Tupaloof TU-144LL by Herpa. The model is beautifully done. I just wish they would have done this model with the canards in the deployed position, but that's just minor stuff. It's still a beautifully done model. The color seems spot on. The print under the canards, in which has the Tupolev, NASA, and Boeing logo is poorly done, and the paint was slightly smudged if touched. Another flaw are the American and Russian flags on the tail, in which both flags are not crisp enough. Everything else is nicely done. The shape of the wing is not quite right. The wings should be longer wingspan wise. Also, if you look closely, you will see a very small seam where the wings and fuselage connect. The engines are beautifully done. Probably the only flaw is that the color of the exhaust is just too light. The landing gear seems to be made from plastic along with the wheels. The wheels on the model don't roll. Another thing is that the model lacks the tail strike wheel. Overall, this is a model I recommend you guys to get since it's a very rare and unique model which will make an excellent addition to your collection. Well that concludes the review for NASA Supersonic Flying Laboratory Tupelo TU-144LL by Herba. If you have this model, let me know what you think about it in the comment section. Please like this video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for the latest reviews. This is Alpha and hope to have you guys back again soon.